People are calling the new Ariel in the new live-action The Little Mermaid, you know, yet another Disney live-action remake because they're creatively bankrupt like the rest of Hollywood. Yeah, people are saying this new Ariel is woke. Some people are really upset about the change. Yeah, that's not woke. All these whiny grift flakes know is that there's a demographic change. There haven't been any other leaks of the production, just that one teaser trailer. All they know is that Ariel is black now, and they're throwing a fit. It's kind of humorous to watch them squirm, honestly. But, I mean, they're squirming all the way to the bank, right? But they're not throwing a fit over wokeness. I mean, Disney could throw some woke stuff into the final production, sure, but all they've given us to look at is this tiny teaser trailer. It's not enough information. Look, woke is when you try to use an academic-based ideological framework to break apart and dismantle the prevailing social systems and constructs in society, such as Christianity, white supremacy, patriarchy, and cis-heteronormativity. Woke is when you label anyone who doesn't want to dismantle those systems using that ideological framework and that ideological vision of society. Yeah, woke is when you want to label anyone who doesn't want any part of that as something that ends in ist or phobic and claim that they're upholding systems of oppression. Woke is when you don't realize or don't care that if you dismantle those systems, you've dismantled society. That's woke. It's not a simple changing of a demographic in a piece of fiction. If changing a demographic in a piece of fiction makes you that upset, you've got some real problems. And let me be clear, I'm not saying that these social systems and constructs that we live under are a good thing. I'm just saying these are the things that we live under, and it's it's ridiculous to try to to just destroy those things without there being something there to replace it. You know, for the most part, we have tamed and declawed these social systems and constructs. And, and we do have a ways to go, but it's kind of looking like we've, we've pushed a little too hard, and it seems they're growing new claws as a reflex. Unless we have something reasonable to replace those systems... The best we can do is try to reduce the negative effects of the systems. I will not actively participate in the dismantlement of society. If you think that makes me a bad person, then so be it. I happen to like Western civilization. If you can show me something better that actually works, and not just on paper, I'm all ears. But again, it can't just be some hypothetical thing on paper. I don't like or support colonialism or imperialism nor the notion of countries continually expanding their borders at the cost of the people who were living there before, nor the notion of wiping out cultures. We should avoid those things as much as possible. But I do like Western civilization, and Disney's attempts to make money are not a threat to it. Just saying.